Solve exponential equations involving quadratic equations. Solve 2 to the power of 2x minus 2 to the power of x minus 12 equals to 0. Well, we can rewrite this equation as 2 to the power of x whole square, right? Minus 2 to the power of x minus 12 equals to 0. Now, if I make a small substitution, that is, let us say 2 to the power of x is equals to term p. In that case, what happens? See, if I substitute p for 2 to the power of x, I get p square minus p minus 12 equals to 0. Now, that is a quadratic equation, right? So, now I can always factor and solve this. I'm looking for two numbers whose product is minus 12 and sum is minus 1. So, the numbers are 4 minus and plus 3. So, I get p minus 4 times p plus 3 in the factored form, right? So that is the solution. Close to solution, I should say. Now if I equate them to 0, I get my solution of what p should be. So p is equals to 4 or it is equals to minus 3. Now you should note that if I write exponential function equals to p, that means I am only expecting positive values, right? It can never be negative. And therefore, p equals to minus 3 is not a solution, right? So this does not provide me with any solution. However, that one is the correct value which can pro provide with a solution. So I get 2 to the power of x equals to p, which is 4. Now 2 to the power of x can be written as 4 as 2 square. And therefore, I get x equals to 2, right? So, x equals to 2 is a solution for the given exponential equation. So, I can write down my answer is x is equals to 2. So, that is a good way of solving exponential equation which are kind of quadratic in form. Thank you.